Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another episode of the Player Career Mode where we're starting things on a sad note. We are without um, Kylian Mbappe for three weeks and Neymar is still only 80% match fit, which means we don't have him for another four days. And as you guys can see by the background, we are back in the Champions League. So we are going up against Roma, who we didn't beat last time we played him um, in the last episode. And we are going to be without our two best players. That being said, we do still have Dolberg up top and we have a Wobi on the left. So it's not the worst thing in the world. But the boys are a little tired because we have, we just came off of another game recently. Um, so it'll be interesting to see how the boys perform in this matchup. Uh, a lot of it's going to rest on uh, ours and Dolberg's shoulder uh, for this game. So we do have to focus up in this matchup. We have to get these points if we don't. We are almost definitely 100% looking at Europa League this season, which is absolutely not acceptable at the level of PSG. We are at home this time. Um, very excited to get into the game. Always, always a joy to play um, against Roma and the boys. Cliver, the big boy legend from the Leipzig career mode we just ended. Um, absolute beast of a man. But let's hop into the episode. Dolberg up top. Can we create... A scoring duo ship over the next three weeks with Dolberg. Let me just get a little cross in here, Dolberg. Ooh. He does have a, a very good heading ability. That could be interesting for us. Oh, what a ball in. I actually didn't think this was going to work. I just kind of threw a ball in to try to get a corner. Dolberg's a beast. A whipped in cross. I don't know how he gets on the end of this. It was also our 75th assist of our career which was absolutely huge. I'm running over like, how did you just score that, man? Are you kidding me? What a freaking finish. What an absolute beastly finish from Dolberg. The diving defender can't get to it. The power he puts into that shot is actually insane. Casper Dolberg with the goal, and we are leading against Roma after losing to them last time out. Let's freaking go, baby. Oh, what a through ball from Dolberg. I get the touch. We're making the run in. Take that. Let's go. We get our goal in the Champions League. Is that our first Champions League goal or is that our second? I can't remember. I'm trying to think, but we do get a goal against Roma. We're 2-0 up, which is absolutely massive. Again, we're going to have to more or less not necessarily win out, but pretty close to win out. We're going to have to score some pretty serious amount of goals in the next few games to make sure that if it does come down to a tiebreaker that we have the goal difference as well. Um, but we do get the goal against Roma. Beautiful little through ball. Controlled it really well. That is our first goal in the Champions League. Let's go, baby. 30 minutes in, 2-0 up against Roma. Oh, we are just absolutely through with so much space. Get it into Dolberg again. Have a shot, son. Oh, what a save from Lopez this time. Well done to keep the ball out. This has been a really good game so far for us. I don't think Dolberg is... Dolberg's a lot closer to the play style of... Um, why can't I not think of his name? Uh, Crivelli. Oh, one day. Um, a lot closer to the play style for Crivelli, so it's a lot easier for me to warm up to him. Obviously, Mbappe is still the better player. And I'll get used to playing with Mbappe, and then we'll really be thriving in this team. Um, but it is kind of nice playing with Dolberg. He has come in a couple times, and we've done pretty well together um, when he has come in as a sub to, to you know, save Mbappe. Um, but it is uh, very... Very fun playing with a, a striker that is similar to Crivelli and then a little bit better as well uh, shooting wise. So I do think that we might have another goal in this game. Um, Leipzig is beating Salzburg. I'm trying to look though is Atletico Madrid is winning their game as well, but only one nil again. Goal difference might come up massive for us in this uh, pseudo group of death. I would say Roma. This Roma squad is actually pretty strong. Uh, full Champions League team, I don't know though. Probably still more of like a Europa League um, champion level team. Um, but I don't know. I don't know. Definitely a game we should have won in the first leg though. Oh wait, Dolberg, huge. Okay, that was just the worst through ball of all time. That one wasn't much better. There we go. Dolberg, have a shot. Let's go. 3-0. And it's our 40th assist from a through ball. Our long passing goes up as well. Three attempted through balls right there, but we finally get past Chris Smalling and Dolberg with the cannon across the body, hits the side netting. Casper Dolberg with the brace, and it's 3 0 against Roma. Let's get it, baby. 
Oh, nice little through ball. Ooh, that pass back was atrocious. Horrible. Roma is pressing right now. And we are going to see if we can get on the back foot. Do a little counter attack here. I see Dolberg maybe making a run. I think he's off by the time I get this ball in. Actually, he might have been on side. If that ball was a little bit better. Maybe I should have whipped the cross. But I was afraid if I, if I did that, it was definitely because of the delay in the actual cross animation. I was afraid it was going to end up being offside. Ooh, nice turn from Laka. Gets the goal. No clean sheet. We're only up by one go or two goals now. Got to try to get another goal here. We want as big of a goal difference as we can get. Beautiful little turn and shoot here from Lacazette. Does what he needs to do. Gets the goal that he needs to get. Oh, such a good turn. Such a good turn. Can't even be mad at a goal like that. Oh, give me that through ball. Give me that through ball. And I got the weak foot goal. It's our 60th goal. Massive milestones in this episode. 75 assists, 60 goals. Um, and then we also got uh, assists with through balls. So a pretty decent episode, not going to lie to you. Only in the first game of the episode so far as well. Absolutely killing it. That through ball is beautiful. It's a weak foot shot as well, which we didn't get an achievement for it. So I think we might still be one more weak foot goal off from getting our weak foot increased. Maybe. Dolberg's coming out. I don't even know who that is coming in, to be honest with you. Who is that? I should have just waited to see the name. The name's going to pop up anyways. Um, Illich. Okay. Not bad. I'm down. 4-1 against Roma. Let's go, baby. How could we not score a goal against them last episode? Oh, Laka with another turn and shoot? Are you kidding me? So the first one is clean. The second one's like, what's our defense doing? You know what I mean? Like, how, how, how are you just getting turned this easily? Why does he even have that space? Ugh, oh, that's disappointing. 4-2. Just holding the ball in the corner. Holding off two different people. That came off of me? That's tragic. <laughs> it's the end of the game anyways, though. Let's go, baby. I think we're back in the league after this. I don't know if we have a cup game coming up soon, but I'm pretty sure we're back in the league for the next game. But we get the 4-2 victory, a plus two goal difference, which when we lost to Roma, I think it was 1-0, so that does help us a little bit. Um, as we do continue to progress uh, the next couple of games are going to be massively important if we can get three points off of Atletico Madrid that is going to be absolutely vital um, locomotive should be the easy game fingers crossed uh, but we do have a league match coming up and again we are currently top of the league but because I think we get Neymar back we do get Neymar back oh I wasn't selected I'm cool with that because my stamina was probably awful uh, Dolberg back up top, Draxler in the middle, and Neymar is playing on the left. Go ahead, quick sim this match up. We do get the 4-0 win. Let's go. Neymar got a double yellow red card and is going to be out of the next league game. Good lord, guys. Can we get it together? Can we get it together? Big boy game against Monaco. Let's go, baby. And Mbappe is back? Is he fully back? Is he in the lineup today? No, not quite. Almost. Let's check the injury list. He is sitting back in training. He has one more week until he is fully back, um, which means we'll have to play another league or another Champions League matchup. And potentially we might have to play against Leo without him as well. Um, but at least he is 100% going to be back for the UEFA Champions League game against um, Atletico Madrid. But let's hop into the second game of the episode against Monaco and see if we can get another win um, in the league and continue to progress. Again, Neymar, double yellow card, uh, gets the red, not able to play in this game. Um, so one day we'll get to play with Neymar. One day. Little through ball out wide to Awobi. Get that cross in. Awobi at some point. Take the heavy touch. Oh, that turn was so bad for me. Get it back center, though. Oh, Ruben Neves. Got to put that one away. Oh. No, don't let him shoot that. No, what are we doing? We're going to let Wigerst? Wigerst? I don't even know how to say his name properly. I've never actually had to say it out loud now that I think about it. We're just going to let him run in behind our defense like that? Ugh. I mean, he's a good striker. Don't get me wrong, but come on now. What are we doing defensively? Oh, let me get that through ball in. 
Give me that shot. Let's go, baby. We get another assist in the episode. We're back to 1-1 against Monaco. Dolberg with the goal. Nice little and easy uh, through ball. I actually didn't think this was strong enough. I thought we might have scuffed it. But he gets it on that left foot. Bangs it in bottom left. Fourth goal in the league, league for Dolberg. And we are 1-1 right at the half against Monaco. Let's keep it going into the second and uh, see if we can get this big boy win. A little ball in for Newhouse. Oh, that shot was actually kind of filthy. Newhouse continues to impress me every time he takes a shot on the ball, man. I asked for this, but I kind of wanted it to go to Dolberg. Ooh, Ruben Neves. Don't know about the bike there. Could have passed it off to a Wobi, but I like the effort. I just got put at center back. Wait, Newhouse. Wait, Dolberg. Oh, dude, I just got put at center back. Wait, not performance, sorry. Player ratings? I'm playing middle center back on top of that? Put Dagba there, what? All right, well, we're playing center back for the rest of this game against Monaco. Don't know how that's gonna go. Ooh, Dolberg. Oh, what a through, no, Dolberg, you had to hit it the first time. I get so antsy whenever I'm playing at center back that I like feel like I have to push up because there's all this open space in this 3-4-3 formation. And I'm like, I could just run up and get the ball right here and then pass it in. It almost worked. Dude, Olympic Leon is dominating right now. Good lord. No, we were going for one more push to end the game. But it does end 1-1 against Monaco. A bit unfortunate. Would have loved to get the win against Monaco. 7.9 rating for us. Uh, my rating started going down whenever I was playing at center back. Because uh, I was playing out of position a lot. But it is what it is. Lee will get the win as well. Which is interesting to see. We'll see how that shakes up the table. Um, currently, we are in that second spot for the Champions League group stages. Um, we have a one goal difference, whereas Roma has a zero. So again, we just have to make sure that we beat Moscow by a heavy margin. And then hopefully we can pull three points off of Atletico Madrid and maybe separate ourselves from Roma, who hopefully loses against Atletico Madrid this week. But we'll see how that goes. Next episode, that is where we will be. Neymar is back for the Champions League. Mbappe will be back, uh, hopefully for the Lille match, uh, coming back from injury. Um, back in training for more days until he is back. So uh, next episode, hopefully we'll get both of them. Mm, one, two, three. He might play in the Leo game. That's a hard maybe. That is a hard maybe. But it'll be interesting to see how it goes regardless. If you guys did enjoy, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And until the next one, I'll see you guys later. Peace. Is it my fault?